Howdy, 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 folks. Izzy here, and I don't know about you, but my god, I get pretty annoyed when I prestige my weapon and I don't have any of my attachments for a long time. Now, luckily, I was scrolling through Reddit earlier, and I came across a post, and I'll put the link in the description. I came across a post that actually showed you how to keep your preferred attachments on the gun even after you've prestiged it. So that's pretty cool, right? I will show you guys how to do that. But before I do, if you guys enjoy this stuff, if you find it helpful, please feel free to leave me a like and subscribe. I would greatly appreciate it. Now, to start off, I will show you, I did this before with my Car 98, just to see if it worked, and of course it did. And I will show you that right now. I mean, just take a look. Okay, you see right here, the bottom here, my primary torpedo, Car 98K, okay? Go to firing range, nothing special, right? And I just prestige this, keep in mind. See, you go weapon level 1. Okay, see, weapon level 1. And then you go up here, this is the copied class, and you see it has these weird little lock symbols on it. Hmm, let's go into a firing range and see. Still, obviously, weapon level 1. Check it out. Ooh, I have the iron sights, and I think I have also ballistic calibration. And I just prestige the weapon, so, right? That's kind of crazy. So I'll show you guys how to do that real quick. So what you're gonna do is you are gonna, you do not wanna leave the menu when you do this, and I'll show you why in a second, okay? Look, for this instance, we're gonna be using the STG44, because it's what I already have ready to prestige. So let's do it. All right, so what you're gonna do is you're gonna wanna copy the class, the division, my bad. Copy the division, right? So you can paste it anywhere. I'll probably just paste it down here because I don't care about this gun. And you see, it still has the option to replace the division. Okay, it's still there. Now what you don't want to do is you want you don't want to leave this menu, right? Because check it out. You come back here, and you can't repaste it. See, you can't paste it. So I'm sure you're thinking, well, how do I how do I prestige this gun? I have to go to the to the to the weaponsmith. No, you don't. I thought the same thing too. I was like, this does this isn't gonna work. All right, but check it out. If you go here and you press the weapon, you can actually prestige the weapon down there, right there at the bottom left-hand corner of the screen. You see that right there, prestige weapon. You just hold hold down triangle or Y, Xbox, whatever it is. Hold that down and you'll prestige the weapon. So you can see it's obviously it's ready to go. So what you're gonna do, again, copy the division and make sure, first of all, make sure you have all the attachments that you want because it's not going to unlock every single attachment. It's just going to unlock the attachments that you already have on the gun. So that means you can't change the weapon. You can't swap it out. You have to keep it. Don't be swapping it out. So if you find the if you find the attachments that you like, keep them on the weapon. Don't take them off so that you can rock through this prestige. Okay? Next thing you're going to want to do, you want to copy it. And what you're going to do is, again, press this good button here and prestige the weapon. Right? Boom. It's good to go. All right, now you're thinking, oh, I lost all my attachments. Well, hang on. Check it out. Paste the division. There it is. Look at that. All the lock symbols there means I have all those attachments on the weapon. So let's test it out. See, I got nothing on this thing. Nothing. Nothing but a bayonet. And then I go down here. Shingles custom. So how'd that happen? Yeah. <laughs> we just did that. So hopefully this will help you guys get through your weapon procedures quickly because you will be able to have all the attachments that you need going forward. So if this did help you guys out in any way, please feel free to leave me a like and subscribe. I'd greatly appreciate it again. <laughs> Alright guys, well that's it for me. Take it easy, and uh, I'll see you in the next video. Have a nice one guys. Later. Save me.